Hi, Timothy Unker here. In this video, we're going to find the sum of the odd numbers from 1 to 100. And we're going to use Python to do it. We're going to use for loops and range. So if I wanted to first print out, let's say, the odd numbers from 1 to 11, I would do something like for number in range 1 and I'm going to put one number higher than 10. If I want to print out the odd numbers from 1 to 10, I would do 11 here. And then I would also do a step, and I would step over every other number. So I would do a step of 2. And now I'll print the number. Okay, I'm going to save this file. And let's open up uh, a terminal and another shell here. And I'm just going to run Python, or run the program with Python 3, and then the name of the program, oddsum.py. And we get the uh, odd numbers from 1 to 10. Okay. Um, all right. So now let's say we wanted to print the odd numbers from 1 to 100. So I would do 1, 101, and then 2. Save it. And now I'd run it. And we see we get... We start with one, we go up to 99 to stop, okay? So that's cool. So now let's say what we wanted to do was find the sum of these numbers. Well, we'd have to start with some variable outside of the loop. We'd call it, let's say, the odd sum and set it equal to zero. And then with inside the loop, we'd say the odd sum equals the odd sum plus number. So every time through the loop, you'd add the number to the list. So this is going to add all the odd numbers. So let's save this. And actually, we want to print out the sum. So we're going to do a print. And let's do an F string. And we can say the sum of the odd numbers from 1 to 100 is, and then within curly braces, we can put the odd sum here and put a period for punctuation. Let's go here and we'll run this program again. And let's run it. And we see the odd sum of the numbers from 1 to 100 is 2,500. And that's basically how you would do it.